This is the kind of thing my mum used to give us when we were used to keep us regular. Is that too much information? Yes. Was that an overshare? <laughs> I've never tasted anything like it. I think I have to taste it then, don't I? I'm not taking too much. No, not at all. I think you could go more. <laughs> Number three. Gary gets a mystery ingredient, but what will it be? The molasses or the buckwheat? This might work and might not. Pomegranate molasses? Both very sweet and syrupy. It's a fusion. Where's no money. It's fine okay, though, because the customers are still, the judges are still like it. <laughs> 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 Is that working for you, Gary? Wow. Just count that quickly. One fifty-five. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> uh oh, looks like he might have to do more than haggle this time as he's dropped a pound. <laughs> what a pound! <laughs> Does this going to all add up? <laughs> <laughs> I was going to ask you for a three pence loan, but no, I'm going to stick to my fifteen pound budget. Okay. So no haggling now. I'm afraid it's the last of my money. Our chefs will have 40 minutes to complete their desserts. Gary has made his fondant mix from butter, sugar, chocolate, egg and flour, and now he's adding a touch of pomegranate molasses. Do it. Do you know what? That could work. Could. That's a lovely texture. Yeah. He's got a lovely texture going on here. You can tell he's exactly. been on Master Chef. <laughs> As a cough like syrup, that? it really As works. Syrup works. <laughs> That's not what I was looking okay. for. Gary has mixed his gin-soaked berries with some of Jamie's yogurt, and his shortbread OT biscuits are out of the oven and looking good. All rests on the chocolate fondant. This is why you should never do chocolate fondant on TV. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know the oven. You don't know the size. Jamie has layered his toffee apple sauce and rice pudding and he's now blowtorching some sugar on top to caramelise it. He's not the only one, though, getting hot under the collar. <laughs> this could end up being a muddy puddle. A muddy puddle. I would enjoy that. So would Jamie. Yep, I would. 90 seconds. Gary, honestly, you're freaking me out. Hurry up, get it on the plate. Make it look nice, make it look nice. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, stop! Gary has made a chocolate fondant served with shortbread and a gin and raspberry yogurt and topped with some oaty biscuit crumbs and a blackberry gin reduction. Jamie has made a rice pudding with a toffee apple surprise underneath and a salted nut crumb on top, served with a side of toffee apple sauce. So will Jamie's rice pudding be the cream of the crop or will our panel be fonder of Gary's fondant? Mmm, they were good, both of them fantastic. I'm not going to mess around, I'm just going to tell you. The dish that was judged to be the better dish was... Mm, mm, mm. Jamie. Oh, well done. The well rice done. pudding took it. 